Hello Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all. What is going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any. And what do you need to know at this moment? So whenever you do see this will be the right time. And as always, take what resonates, leave out the rest, practice using your own discernment. Don't forget to follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I'm spiritually golden on all platforms. And if you're interested in a personal reading done by myself or my sponsor, all of that information will be left in the description box below for you all. And with that said, don't forget to like, comment. Let's get into this. Someone has, someone misses you. I'm seeing someone, someone has been missing you. Somebody has been not honest about how they've been feeling. I'm seeing you're doing a lot of shadow work. So inner work, healing, taking time for yourself, taking a break for your for yourself, taking time to rest and recover and plan out your next move. I see you've been doing a lot of thinking over like what to do next, but also going within and taking time out for yourself. It's like you're, I see you're wanting to be fair and honest about, about something. Mm, about, about your feelings, Knight of Cups. So I see you kind of going back and forth with a decision and really doing inner work on how you feel about a situation. How do you, maybe how do you feel about a, a person around you? I'm seeing a lot of family around you. So with this 10 of pentacles, it feels like you're being surrounded by a lot of family or you're staying home. I'm seeing a lot of family support. I'm seeing a lot of communication coming in, back and forth communication. So there's going to be some sort of communication coming in from family. Uh, about a gathering. So I see you gathering with people, celebrating, and I'm seeing that you're you're starting to take action towards I'm seeing a move. So a home a move in home or residence even. But I do see you looking at a situation right now like something there needs to be a move with that chariot somebody needs to make a move or, or make a journey travel you may feel like something's moving really quickly and there needs to be a decision but i do see you being a little indecisive so who this may be about marriage about a wedding about like a, a commitment, a serious commitment. You may feel like things are kind of moving really quickly in a situation and I see you kind of being in this place where you're wanting to put a stop to something in order to stabilize yourself and take care of yourself and focus on, on yourself with that Queen of Pentacles energy. Maybe it's your finances, wanting to improve your finances, but I, I see you wanting to put a stop to something right now. It's like you're still you're still trying to make a decision. There is someone around you who you view this person as it's like you think they're no longer thinking of you. And I'm seeing that you you view this person as giving giving um and in, investing to possibly other other responsibilities or even people that are in their energy. So it feels like I'm hearing forgotten. You may feel like they they've forgotten about you in a way. But I do see with this page of cups it feels like 
a message wanting to ex wanting to explore these feelings that you're feeling i'm hearing new so you may have these these like new feelings that you've never felt before with anybody and so now you're doing shadow work and it may have like un blindsided you in, in a way you didn't think you would feel this way so quickly but i do see with this three of cups it's you're looking at a situation like I do see you going either to a wedding or I'm seeing a celebration, a gathering where you're celebrating something and it's going to take some sort of like movement. So I'm hearing responsibilities. You have other responsibilities right now. Let's take a look at this person around you. Could be Cap a Capricorn. So it looks like at some point they were like obsessed, like obsessed with you. Devil reverse though, it's like they're starting to break free from, from this obsession. I'm saying they look at this situation like there is a, a spark. There's, there's a flame here that could grow into something more, but they see this as uh, like there's chemistry. But they view you as like having fun and enjoying your life as it is without them. And so with this storm warning, it's like they they feel like there's some sort of red flag. Or they're, they're starting to see flags. They may feel like maybe you like to party or something like that. But they see you as really enjoying their, your, your life and for some reason, they're viewing that as, as like uh, something that's scary to them. And they're not a part of it. I say that kind of stuck on you in a way. Their head is in knots over this situation. And I do see them trying to move on from you. Moving on, but also waiting at the same time. So, and again, like with the Six of Swords and Three of Wands, this does feel, and Chariot, it does feel like travel. So it's like they're waiting for a decision to be made about travel. And this kind of has them stuck. But they're waiting for a message. They feel like right now things aren't really working out. Or there's like, there's a, there's... The opportunity and the potential to work things out here, but it's just stagnant right now. I'm seeing free will, so this person may be in this energy where they feel like you you just like to have your freedom or you're not ready you're not ready for a commitment. But I see them wanting to have some forgiveness or, or reconciliation or some sort of apology. They want to start over with you, runner. But I'm seeing that this person or somebody had ran. Somebody ran. Somebody was afraid to, to, to make a deeper commitment. You're going to get the truth. And I see you're, you're going to have the clarity in regards to this, you're gonna you're gonna know what 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 you want. I'm seeing telepath telepathy, so it feels like there's some sort of telepathy going on with you and this person. Like you communicate telepathically or you finish each other's sentences or like when you think of them they message you or something like that. I'm seeing family. Healing. There's going to be a lot of healing and family healing as well. So I'm seeing a lot of healing within a family. And there's going to be truth and clarity over why somebody had like ghosted. I'm seeing Spirit is asking you right now to... 
stabilize because I see that's where you're kind of headed. You do have an opportunity, a golden opportunity come in. I'm seeing that this is with this this is something solid that could that has the potential to be long lasting and stable for you. Somebody who's wanting to make a commitment. Single. So this person is single. And Spirit is asking you to continue manifesting because you have a manifestation coming in. And Spirit is saying you're not stuck. If you feel stuck, you're not stuck. You have an offer coming from somebody who you've had past lives with. Okay. A decision needs to be made. So it's time to make a decision. It's time to speak your truth. But with this owl, you're gonna have the wisdom. You're gonna you're gonna learn something from this. And I do see you stepping into this energy where you're you're gonna speak your truth as well and being honest, taking responsibility for for actions that have happened, your actions or your responsibility. Um, when it comes to also like forgiving yourself, I see you working a lot. I see you focusing more on your work. It feels like this person's defensive or guarded towards you. But I do see that, wow, you have success and abundance coming in. I see you being honest about the fact that you're just not ready um, for like a serious commitment or you just want to focus on stabilizing your life and your abundance and success because that's what I see happening here I see you taking control over your, your life and not doing things because other people want you to do them or like what they think you should do or because you feel bad for someone like no you're stepping into this energy where you're the boss of your own life if you don't want something you're not going to uh, compromise to make someone else happy I'm seeing the numbers 4 15 7 4 4 the letters s w t so those numbers could be birthdays and the letters could be either in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. This is what I'm picking up. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so, so much for watching. I hope that you have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.